Um, I talked a little bit about starting Born Age 12 years ago, but what I really want to talk to today about is choice, and about personal choice, and making choices with the right information. And that's really the goal of why we started publishing the directory, because as many of you know, I have been a part of this organization for at least eight years, and I don't know most of you in this room. And so we all carry little directories in our head of the people we know and the people that we're going to make our referrals to, but we don't have the real big picture. And so I publish these directories so that we have a place for the big picture. If you look up here at the website, the first thing you'll notice is the picture of my mother there on the left. <laughs> because when that picture was taken, I really looked like her. And I said, people say, well, you don't look like your mom. And I said, well, I want people to be able to recognize that this is a real personal business. This is something that when you call Born to Age, you're going to speak to me. I'm going to pick up the phone and talk to the senior. I'm going to call the senior back. I'm going to call the family back, and I'm going to meet with them. And they're going to see my picture. And just like you see on the cover, if you pick up the cover, all of your pictures are on the cover so that people know who you are as well. It's a way of forming community. It's a way of forming a place where we can recognize each other, even though we can't always remember our names, right? <laughs> Which is why the name tags have gotten really, really important. Um, we do the website so that people can have access to the directories. And if you click on any of the directories at the bottom, you can enter the directory right away. And what I try to do there is list as many businesses, as many nonprofits. I compare prices of the mortuaries. We provide uh, information on end-of-life care. And if you open them up, you can actually download the directory right off the website. I get calls all the time from people all over the country asking me to, to send them a directory or whether they can download a directory. The reason I'm really pushing the directories right now is 2012 edition is coming up and my deadline is December 1st for the 2012 edition. If all of you get in, we have a really good directory. And if half of you get in, we have a really good directory. People look at the directories as a place for consumer information. I gave them out at the Marin County Fair. I went through uh, 500 directories in two hours. People were coming to the table saying, I heard about this directory, can I have a copy? So the word is out about the directory. I want to make it as comprehensive as possible. Now with the directory, when I was going out and placing it around the community, what we noticed was that there weren't places to put the directories. That people put them on tables, people put them in chairs, people put them in places, but there wasn't a place. So we developed the kiosk business. And, and Bob, if you want to go to the kiosk business, um, we developed the kiosk. And there's a kiosk actually in the back of the room so you can see what they look like. And we welcome you to join us in the kiosk business. Um, we have um, already we have 64, 64 kiosks, 66 kiosks up in the North Bay, Solano, Napa, and Sonoma counties. We welcome you to join us. It's a way, it's a very passive way of getting people to uh, get understand who you are, that you're in the senior business, this is your name out there in the community. We have a lot of these kiosks in pharmacies, retirement homes, that sort of thing. And the last thing that we do, I'm going to have Julie talk about the kiosk business a little bit, because she's really the one who's going to talk to you about who you'll be talking to about kiosk, she's the manager. <laughs> Hello, my name is Julie Waters, and like Yvonne said, I actually run the kiosk part of Born to Age. And I, I'm i out there, I see the kiosks, I see where we put them in place, I actually know what brochures we put in place, I'm seeing what's working, what's not working. So I'm actually the one that will, be, you know, if you want to contact me, I'm more than happy to help you in any which way to um, give you information about the kiosks. And like Yvonne said, it's a great way to get your information out there besides the directories. Um, what we're finding is as you know, I'm going to all these places, a lot of these places have maybe a lot of your brochures out there, but what's happening is that your information's kind of being in a cluttered area where it's just kind of combined with a bunch of other information and then people are putting their stuff in front of your stuff or your stuff is becoming a mess. And so what I'm finding is that for facilities, they are really, liking these kiosks, because if you look back there, it's very nicely organized. We go every other week and maintain the kiosk, so they know that if somebody's going to be there on an every, week, every other week basis, that's going to take care of this, this information. So for the purpose for you, as well as if you're interested in hosting one of these kiosks, 
um, there's those benefits. There's those benefits to have that resource in your facility, to have all this great information, but in a nice organized, and, and it's gonna be kept organized way. And then it's great for you guys who are going out there to all these places that don't have that time to go out and put your information out there and to know that it's, it's gonna stay in that place and it's not gonna be taken away or pulled out. Um, so this is something that uh, we are encouraging you to, for all of you to be a part of. And um, we are actually in Napa County and Solano County and now we have now developed in Sonoma County. And we're moving through different counties to put these in place because we know that people are really liking it. It's becoming a great resource. So please feel free to contact me. I'd be more than happy to give you more information. <coughs> One last thing. Photo opportunity for the director. All the advertisers get on the cover December 12th, 10 a.m. at Valley Orchards in Petaluma. <coughs> Thank you.